If I told you that five years ago, I made one simple change in my nutrition coaching business that doubled my income in half the time and left my clients happier than ever, you'd wanna learn what I did, right? Which is why in today's video, I'm gonna show you exactly what that change was and how you can use it to take your nutrition coaching check-ins to the next level, delivering better client results in less time so you can make more money and create more impact. This process is called the hybrid check-in and it's going to impress your clients and blow away your competition. Here's how most nutrition coaches course respond with their clients. Once they get their nutrition clients set up, they're going to give them a plan and they're going to encourage them to reach out when they need some help or if they have any questions. And they'll schedule meetings to discuss how things are going. Now, sometimes these meetings can be in person, so there is a travel aspect. But even if it's online, there's some sort of scheduling that needs to happen. And this isn't just me assuming this is how nutrition coaches do it. Recent survey data has shown that many nutrition coaches are using this meeting format. And if you want to work with 20 to 25 clients as nutrition coach so you can make a professional wage, you've probably realized that scheduling this many meetings per week or even every other week just isn't going to happen. It's just not scalable. And if you haven't realized this yet, let me save you some time and some frustration and show you a different way to do your check-ins, a better way. Here's how you'll do it with the hybrid check-in, starting with number one, set up the weekly check-in structure. You're gonna wanna set this up so your nutrition client knows when and where to submit feedback, including some tracking data, as well as some answers to questions that's gonna give you some insight on how things are going. And all this is gonna get sent directly to your inbox and your clients are gonna know what happens when they don't submit it. Next up, we have number two, your response. Your response isn't gonna be a discussion in a live call or a meeting. You don't need that and your clients don't want that and they'll appreciate doing it another way. You're gonna review what they submitted and give your response and your next action steps using a video recording. And I'm gonna go over the exact way to respond and what sort of technology to use in a second. And number three, we have the delivery. With your video feedback, you're gonna deliver it to them in a way where they can watch it. So it's personal, but also individualized, but also leaves a paper trail so you know exactly what you said and what sort of feedback you gave. So everything stays organized and all all in one place. This happens every week on the same day, with the once per week being the sweet spot because this gives the client enough time to actually put your feedback into practice and not so much time that you're not close enough to the actual coaching process. After working with thousands of nutrition clients over the last 10 years, this is the best way I've found to do this. The hybrid check-in is efficient and effective, but it's also streamlined. So you don't need to necessarily meet with your clients to do a good job coaching, but you can still verbally describe all the important necessary details for them to get good results. And truthfully, your clients are gonna like it better this way. Although live meetings are good for helping you develop a relationship with your clients, the live meetings can contain too much small talk or discussion that's unrelated or unnecessary. This gets right to the point and it's best for everyone involved. You don't need to do live check-ins and you certainly do not need to do them in person. Now, I do wanna break this process down even further so you have all the strategies and tools and templates you need to integrate it into your coaching right away. And you're gonna to wanna to do this. I've taught hundreds of nutrition coaches in my certification program to do this, but also ones that just follow me. And even some that haven't taken my certification program have said this is the best thing they've implemented into their coaching. You're gonna learn exactly how to do it next, but before we jump into that, if you're just getting started nutrition coaching and maybe you've finished a basic nutrition certification where you feel like you've learned a lot about the science, but you're not exactly sure what to do next. Number one, Take comfort in knowing you're not alone. This is a very common problem. But I also have a brand new three-day nutrition coaching quick start challenge that's gonna give you everything you need to start coaching nutrition clients. And this is nearly a thousand dollar value, but today I'm gonna pay for it because I know it's gonna give you everything you need to get started. This is the exact sort of problem that we're solving in the Dr. Mark method. So go to the first link in the description below and you'll get instant access to it. But for now, let's break down the hybrid check-in process even more. When I say this is the most important change I've made in my nutrition coaching, business, I'm not just saying that. It's literally saved me hundreds of hours of my time and helped me infuse more of my personality into my coaching. To use technology to leverage more talking instead of just more writing. This makes it easier to communicate key points that you want your clients to do and with practice it becomes much faster. Plus my clients feel like they're being taken care of by their coach because they get to see me and hear me talking about how their week went. And infusing video into this makes the interaction so much smoother. Think about your favorite actor or movie star. Once you've watched enough of them on video, you start to kind of feel like if you saw them on the street, you could go up to them and start a conversation, feeling like you actually knew them. And you don't, but you've seen them speak on video so much that you start to feel like you do. And that's the power of working video into this process. But 
you can't do it live and you can't just take a video of yourself and send it over. You want to address things in a step-by-step -step way so it remains effective. And it's very simple to do, but you might not know how to do it unless you see me incorporate it. So let's start with step number one. And that's the streamlined check-in form. To make this process even more straightforward, you want your clients to be filling out a check-in form every week. The questions you ask should be specific enough to your approach, but you can use the same questions in the same form for all of your clients. As you can see here, this is one version of the form I've used since 2018. 18, and it has over 4,300 plus entries to it. I've done this process a lot. My clients always know where to find it because it's at the top of their tracking sheet. And I deliver this all through Google Forms and I have a plugin that sends the responses directly to my email. So I can respond directly to them there and also include my video response in the check-in. You're gonna wanna include questions on your check-in form that allow your clients to reflect on their week, plus gives you an opportunity to assess how they're doing. Here are some of my favorite questions to include. Describe Describe any successes you had this week. Describe any setbacks or issues you had this week. Do you foresee any challenges or anything you need to plan for this week, like social events, travel, vacation? When we ask our clients these questions, it gives them an opportunity to pause and reflect and sort of self-coach themselves and add their insight on how they feel things are going. And then we can address them in our check-in. So once we have this actual information, here's how we respond. Step two, video and clear action steps. Here's the game changer. We wanna work elements of video Video into our check-in. Having clients see your face, talk about their week and review it is one of the smartest things you can do. And again, you don't need to do this live or in person. Here's how you do it. Using some screen capture or screen recording technology, I personally use an app called Loom that allows me to point and talk over what I'm seeing or what I'm hearing and communicate that way. It's much more streamlined and effective. It allows me to point to and discuss what I'm changing instead of having to describe what I'm changing. The process typically goes as follows. Follows. I start with pleasantries. Then I talk about what I'm seeing positively about their week. There's always a positive, even if it's just them checking in. You gotta find the positive and talk about it and compare it against how far they've come. Then talk about how well they stuck to their plan with how you're measuring adherence. Then we can point out some areas to improve. Then we make any adjustments or we talk about how we're keeping the plan the same. Regardless of any changes we make or if we keep things exactly the same, we wanna point out one to two action items for them to do this week. This could be the same thing if it's working or something different to keep them engaged in the process. We want to talk this over in a two to three minute video review, maybe sometimes upwards of five minutes if you're new and just getting used to things. The free version of Loom only allows you to have a five minute recording before you go over and have to go into the paid version. So it's a nice natural cutoff anyway. I use Loom. I feel it's the best for a few reasons and I'm not getting any money to say this, but the screen capture is very fast and it's easy to use. It's intuitive. Plus once you're done done recording, you get an actual link to send over, which means you don't have to download any files or upload or store them. Although you can download them and post them in places if you actually want the file. You can check out a free trial of Loom in the description below. Now this hybrid check-in process is going to save you time, but also give your clients the feeling that they're getting access to you. Hear your voice and really give them the feeling that they're working with their coach. This saves time on both sides. It's very effective and in my view is best practice as an online nutrition coach. This leads to better client results, which is also going to lead to you making more money as a nutrition coach. And here's how you integrate it into your check-in with the right delivery. Step number three, you're going to combine it with an email response. So now you have a great video to include in your check-in, but here's how you send it over to your clients. You still want to include it as an email response. Why? Because it's the best way to pass along this information in a professional way. Probably the most important thing that you want to do is make clear in the written communication what is going to change and what your clients need to do moving forward. Number one, sometimes this takes repeating yourself, but by writing it out, you're also gonna have a paper trail for yourself so you don't have to rewatch your own videos. So you can quickly pop open last week's email and quickly review what's been discussed and what should have been done. How do you finalize this check-in? With clear action steps of what they need to do and what's next. And you also wanna get them involved. And this is what we do in step number four, clear communication and getting them involved. To get great client results, you're gonna need to be prescriptive. So you wanna identify identify in your client's nutrition areas for improvement and prescribe the action steps for where your client will fix this. But you can't always just tell them, you want to get them involved in the solution as well. And I know many of you ask me, well, how much talking should me and my nutrition client do after the check-in process? Like, what does that look like? Generally, after you send this email, there's gonna be a little bit of back and forth, probably a few emails, where you discuss how likely they are to be able to nail the solution and how bought in are they. And this shouldn't take the entire week. It 
it should be over the course of the day after you send the check-in. Here's an example of some of this correspondence. So if protein intake was an issue for your clients, you could pose the following as an action step. So I made a note of protein intake as the biggest area or room for improvement on your week. What are two things that you can do this week to improve it? Or being prepared seems to be your biggest issue. On a scale of one to 10, how likely are you to prepare one batch meal this week or one batch protein source? Then you go back and forth communicating the best course of action for your client. This gives your client the chance to agree to the solution, which also makes them more likely to do it because it's no longer you telling them what to do, it's what they've already agreed to be doing. And that's the type of self-efficacy that's gonna give them the chance to build habits and get results for the long term. And that's it folks, that's the hybrid check-in. You're gonna wanna get this process set up for your nutrition clients now, even if you only have a handful of clients or none at all, because it's gonna set you up to scale your coaching business and help more people. Collect information in advance, use technology to deliver a personalized service without having to do it live, and therefore deliver a better client experience. This is the hybrid check-in and it's taken my nutrition coaching business to the next level. Use it to save time, provide a better service, and make more money. Use it in your nutrition coaching business and let me know how it goes. Now, as great as all these tips are, if you're really serious about starting a nutrition coaching business, the next thing I'll have you do is check out this video I have right here. If you wanna use the hybrid check-in process, you probably wanna see me do it. I'm gonna do three check-ins in under 15 minutes right here. So check it out right now and I'll see you in the next video.